Hey guys, how's it going? So if your PUBG doesn't start, I'm going to try and help you in this video. So if you get a message when you start PUBG from Steam that says something like starting battle eye service, launching game, and then note, file blocks can be ignored if they don't cause problems with the game. If you see this message flashing up when just as you start PUBG and then it, it crashes to desktop again, it might be something to do with uh, the antivirus or anti-malware software that you're running on your computer. Now, what happens is you're running these uh, antivirus or anti-malware programs and then you download a new version of PUBG and, and try and run it. What it does is it actually moves the, the um, PUBG files into the virus quarantine and then uh, the, the game thinks that some of the files are not actually there and then therefore it, it, it crashes it crashes to desktop and, and then you can't ever start your game. Another symptom of this problem is if you if you're in Steam and you keep getting updates for PUBG um, so you might find that you're not able to update PUBG to the latest version and you you're kind of in a loop where you, you press update and then uh, it, it updates successfully and then you you try and launch the game and then it asks to to update again or it, it says it gives you an error and it says that some files are missing so that's another symptom of this this issue and basically what's happening is your anti-malware software is moving the PUBG files into its own virus quarantine before the game starts so then the game starts uh, it will it will think that the files are missing and then basically crash to desktop the best way that you can fix this is to go to your uh, anti-malware software and put an exception for the PUBG folder. So um, this is kind of the, the easiest way, you know, to keep keep your anti-malware protection and then uh, keep, keep playing uh, the, the game as well or, or be able to start the game successfully. Now, sometimes this actually doesn't work. Um, because there, there are files to do with uh, the anti-cheat software which is which comes with PUBG which is called BattleEye so that there might be a problem where these files are somewhere else and you know you missed the exception or there's uh, there's just something wrong with that so you could also try disabling your anti-malware software altogether and uh, and then trying to play the game um, when you do try to play the game with with the uh, antivirus off or the anti-malware off um, you should verify the integrity of your files and that will uh, download any any files that were missing from before and then you can uh, run the game successfully. Uh, uh, finally, if, if you can't get any of that working with the exceptions, uh, the, probably the best thing that you can do is just uninstall your, uh, un uninstall your anti-malware software because, um, you know, it, it might not be, it might not be uh, too compatible with, with other games. And and this uh, battle eye anti cheat system seems to be quite uh, quite common in a lot of recent games such as Rainbow Six Siege and and PUBG. Um, so I'm afraid you'll you'll probably have to stick with Windows Defender or the Windows built in uh, anti malware stuff um, to 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 keep on playing these games. So I hope this video has helped out, and um, I'll see you guys next time.